Feed My Sheep Today Kenya is coming back to you with another massive work. This time, we are going to be visiting different churches. We are taking the gospel and Bibles to the new believers and to the members that are there and also to the church leaders with study Bibles. And we are also going to be visiting orphanages and we are going to be delivering food to them. We are also going to make sure that we feed them and also to provide some sanitary towels to these orphanages. And we are also visiting prisons where we will be providing some mattresses, some blankets, some bed sheets, and also Bibles, sanitary towels, as soaps, and some tissues, amongst so many other things. But the main, main thing we are taking the good news to these people in the prisons, to these people in the urban lands, the rural lands. They need to know that time is running and the end will soon be here. I want to ask you to join me in prayers wherever you are. Pray with us. And if at any way you are able to support this cause, don't be afraid. Don't stay away. Send your support, stand with us financially in prayers and ask the Lord will lead you so that we can, in an amazing way, reach these people, clothe them and bless them with their needs and also feed them because they are angry, they are naked and they need us and we are the ambassadors of Jesus Christ. Let's join hands together with you and let's do this for the glory and honor of God. God bless you. Feed my sheep today. God bless you. Everyone who is going to pray and everyone who is going to support. Hello and praise Jesus. I'm so much glad to let you know that today, together with my team, we were able to visit Shining Stars Children's Home and we blessed them with some package of foods and we were also able to feed them with some food. Hello, this is Feed My Ship Today Kenya and we're here at Shining Star Children's Home. We're very happy for the provision of everything. As you can see, each and every student here is enjoying their meal and they are very, very thankful and we brought some gifts today here for the children at least so that they can feed on a meal. To ensure that they are in good health and they are, have a smile in, on their faces. And it was just amazing to go in a children's home in such a situation, in such a location and just to see those children there waiting for someone who could visit them and show them the love of God. And that is our mission on earth to visit the, uh, the orphaned children and to show them love just to make them feel that Jesus loved them and that we love them and from wherever you are I want to encourage you to continue praying with us I want to encourage you to always remember us in everything that you do in a uh, whenever you are praying that every time God will bless and provide that we are able to visit several orphanages like this one that we have visited today and be a blessing to them even more than what we have provided today. May God bless all of you. May God bless Feed My Sheep today in the name of Jesus Christ. able to go together with my team to visit Kisi Women Prison and we had a very wonderful uh, day there with the inmates, the, the, uh, the police uh, women and men in that prison and we were able to worship God and praise God together and share the word of God and it was just amazing. We danced unto the Lord and they were so full of joy in that prison. I tell you today they even forgot that they are in prison because they saw Jesus with us and what they could think next was freedom. 
and we want to thank the Lord because as we were taking the word of God to the prison the Lord also blessed us with some gift that we took there we had some mattresses that we blessed them with some blankets and some bed sheets and what stood out for me today that made me so happy and to thank God was that the prison was started in Kisi in 1975 and since then they have never have a bed sheet and so today the bed sheet that the Lord blessed us with that we took there are the first ever bed sheets that they have received and that was amazing and just amazing and today we they even have wonderful beds there which we uh, uh, help them to put the new mattresses and the new bed sheets and the new blankets and today they are going to have a warm sleep you are amazing for praying for us and for helping us make these women feel much love the freedmanship May the Lord bless you. May the Lord give you more so that you may always remember that the women who are in prison in all over the country, uh, even as you remember these women. We feel so much, feel appreciated and feel uh, uplifted. Thank you so much. And don't get tired standing with us, with us all the time. And God Almighty bless you and do you good all the time. Feed my ship today. Thank you.